So yeah, this is the old bridge. I'm now heading back over it. My mother and my great-grandmother and I walked over this thing a bunch of times in the late 1950s and early 1960s. This is new, this particular part. It looks like it's designed for bicyclists. When we were coming through here as I was a kid, this didn't exist. You would just walk up the steps here. It's an overlay. And there you have some fine dining. The river ever flowing. It's funny how it goes all the way up to Redding, where my father came from. And then, reputedly, there will be a trail that connects to the Bay Circuit in Andover, following this river. So this is interesting. It's like got a little baffle. to keep you from going too fast. Yeah, you can see the details of the old stairs we used to ascend. The steps are small and accommodating to a toddler. Now, we're crossing it once more, and this is where we should see beginnings of the underway trail system. See, here's the backside of that old armory now it turned into speculators bonanza over here none of these towns were considered particularly tony or valuable through much of my life yeah, it looks like we have a little wino hangout over there for some reason during the grand buildup of inflation, asset inflation in the 1990s. Little ridiculous Massachusetts all of a sudden became stupidly valuable. So valuable that its inhabitants could barely afford to live there. Hello, a sign indicating the commencement of Mystic Valley Parkway and the Mystic Reservation. We'll attempt to traverse the torrent of traffic. Wish me luck. Now, first rapids crossed. Motorism is rampant here in the idiot part of the Commonwealth. All right, a break in a quantum packet. Like that. So this is supposedly the general beginning of the proposed system for a trail all the way up to at least Woburn and Redding. It, I've followed it on Google Satellite and it really does look kind of sketchy when you start talking about up around the devastated, polluted, horrible parts of Woburn and utterly overbuilt and shabby, wretched Redding. Ooh, a little 
acknowledgement of the role of the shipbuilding industry. Now my mom's place is over on the other side of the river. It's also possible that the locus for that old photograph could be over here somewhere. There seem to be a lot more little boat launches than I recall. They're probably there all along. This basin was probably all you needed for building ships at the scale of the times. Huh. Yeah, 200 buck fine for pooch shit. Nice little park. There's the old band shell. Ooh, is this like a boat launch for your kayak? Let's investigate. It most probably is. That was probably an old Ford or ferry or something here at some bygone time. There's a bunch of little docks. Yeah, it's a nice little canoe launch and the trail seems to be maintained with crushed rock, rock dust I think is what they call it here. Out west it had different names. You can kind of see the back side of Medford, an old church. Various signage we'll investigate momentarily. see what these signs are about. <coughs> Knowing Massachusetts, they're, they'll be loaded with scintillating and potentially useful information. Let's see, this one is Medford on the Mystic. This one is ships, rum and bricks. And this one is changes to the mystic. Love it. And there's nothing on the back sides. The little parkway is a relic of the days before super highways. Probably went to things here in the late 1950s. Generally, it's a completely pleasant urban amenity. They haven't gaudied it up. And look oh, over there. Here's grandfather's house or grandmother's house, depending on how you interpret the lyrics. That thing, which we'll be exploring momentarily, it's now home to the Tufts Provost, but it's from over the river and through the woods to grandfather's house we go. That's where they were going. Now you know. Good bird action. Yeah. We got an old broken limb providing aquatic refuges for heaven knows what. And here's the shell. Ooh, look at how dolled up it is.
Lydia Maria Child had something to do with this, evidently. Oh boy, get more of that sort of neo Stalinist municipal earth mural art that the Commonwealth simply loves. Oh, I see. Lydia was the one who wrote that tune. Over the river and through the wood, look, we have the lyrics. Good heavens, how appropriate for a band show. And as I expected, we're fairly close to grandfather's house, so we're just going to have to examine it. I don't think I'm going to go all the way up to lower Mystic Lake today. This heads off in the direction of West Medford. And I think I'll examine that on another day. <coughs> it's time to take a look at the neighborhood of my earliest origins. And recall it to the best of my aging and feeble ability. And as ever, it seems wherever I go on a trail, there's always a red, red robin that's bob, bob, bobbing along. <laughs> See you, robin. So, I would imagine the trail aims to go down this way where this trash truck is backing out ineptly into traffic. They'll figure it out though. So that's the way to Medford Center, Medford Square. And that's the trail. This is where we'll start when I continue exploring the Mystic River. Now we'll cross over into the neighborhood. Yeah, someone's bobber. More cool old stone work. Cross over and take a look here. This is a fairly quiet street. Still fairly broad, deceptively so, considering what a funny little river it is. <laughs> 